Hey, what's up everybody? It's Styles with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to get a color matching material design status bar on any device. Now these days, stock Android looks a lot better than manufacturer skins like TouchWiz, and that's mainly because of material design. Animations and icons are prettier, and there's a lot of emphasis on color throughout the whole system. But even though you'll get some of this on skin devices that run Lollipop or higher, most phones still use a clunky status bar design. So developer James Finn came up with a unique way to get stock Android status bar on pretty much any device, regardless of Android version or manufacturer tinkering. Amazingly enough, it doesn't require root, because it's basically just overlaying a customized status bar on top of your existing one. So the end result is that your notification tray will still be stock but the actual status bar on top of every screen will be material design. The app itself is called Status, and you can find it on the Google Play Store. But if the search function isn't working out for you, you can use the link in step one in my full tutorial. And when you first launch the app, there's a few additional permissions that you'll have to grant, and they're all legit. So first, tap the button next to Accessibility Service, then scroll through this next page and look for the Status Service entry. Once you've selected that, just enable the option then press OK on the pop-up. After that, tap your back button a couple times to head back to the app. Then select the Notification Access option. From here, it's pretty much the same. So select the Status Service option, then enable it, and press OK. When you're done there, you'll have to grant a pair of additional permissions if you're running Android Marshmallow or higher. So tap the last Grant Access button, then press Allow on each of the subsequent pop-ups. When you're done with all that, you're ready to try the app, so tap the check mark at the bottom of the screen. From here, enable the first switch to turn on the status bar service itself, then you'll see the new icons. Beneath that, there's the material design status bar coloring option, and it does a good job of color matching your current app by default. But if you find that the new status bar doesn't quite match an app's color, you can tap this add apps button to set a custom color value. When you do that, you'll see a list of apps. Just enable the switch next to any troublesome apps, then use the RGB sliders to manually set a color for your status bar when you're using that app. Aside from that, you can opt to show an AM PM indicator on the clock or battery percentage text, as well as dark icons when your status bar is the light color. But with everything set up, all that's left to do is try it out. You'll find that the color matching feature works pretty well, though it can be delayed for a fraction of a second when you first open an app. It works with pretty much every app I've tried so far, but of course you got those per app color settings if it doesn't. And then like I said, you still keep your existing notification tray, since this is just overlaying your ugly old status bar. So when you swipe down, you'll still see the stock quick settings and whatnot, but when you're in an app, you'll get full material design at the top. And this is a brand new app, so you might experience a few little bugs depending on your device, but the developer has been extremely active so far, so I'm sure there will be a quick fix for anything you find. Really, it's an inventive approach to Android theming, and it gets you that stock Android look and feel. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.